you always want to make sure that you're starting out with all of the ohm load of your subs matching. If one of the ohm loads is a 2 ohm or an 8 ohm and you're trying to use all fours or whatnot, you'll run into issues at the amplifier, you'll have a speaker pull more current draw than the rest, and the system won't sound right. So always start out with your subs being the same ohm load. The way to wire them up in series, we'll start on the back side of our subs. The single voice coil has one positive and one negative. So what I'll do is I'll take an individual piece of wire, I'll start from one of my subs negatives, and I'll go to the center subs positive. I've gone negative to positive. Do the same thing with the remaining left over. Go from the negative of the center sub, positive of this sub. So negative, positive, negative, positive. It's going to leave me a positive and negative that are unused between this whole bank of three. This will work, power out just fine. Take the negative of my speaker lead that goes in my amp, go to the negative of this sub, my positive, it's going to run to my amp, goes into this sub. So here's three woofers wired in series. Thank you.